Uh, good morning to all. Uh, now we are going to study uh, the voltage to frequency and frequency to voltage converters. Uh, here, uh, first we will study the voltage to frequency converter. Um, so, yes, uh, uh, voltage to frequency converter and uh, frequency to voltage uh, converters includes the uh, 909400 yes includes uh, as you can see that 9400 9401 9402 uh, ic uh, converters uh, these all are having almost similar connections Okay, so 9400 series consists of CMOS and bipolar device that can operate on dual or single supply voltages. Now we, we are going to see a 9400 voltage to frequency converter. All of you look into this circuit. Uh, this is the circuit you need to understand this see this circuit so here whatever is represented in this dotted representation is the IC 94000 okay and the other thing outside of this dotted what we need to connect extra okay so this is a what are all the what all are the important yes what all are the important structure as you can see here i will start from here this is the input voltage there is a resistor the corresponding current is considered or voltage to frequency voltage first it is voltage divided by resistor that current is con uh, considered for charging the capacitor we will see the working. We will first see which all are the important uh, components in uh, 9400 voltage to frequency converter. Here you can see a uh, uh, pump. Uh, this forms an integrator circuit. This forms an integrator circuit or pump using this capacitor across this. This forms an integrator uh, circuit. Now, the output of this, you can see that it is connected to a comparator. The output of the comparator is connected to a 3 microsecond delay. So, after 3 microsecond, if here there is a change from 0 to 1, that change will be reflected all, uh, only after 3 microsecond here. Now, uh, here you are having a VB1 that is connected to Q1 and Q2. Okay, so you can see the uh, two transistors. And here, you, uh, as you can see here, this is a divided by two circuit. That means the frequency is divided by two. And uh, this is act as a yeah, negative edge triggered flip off is used here negative edge triggered during the negative trigger only it is activated as you can see here now yeah negative edge triggered you can see here that is connected to q2 and the same output is connected to c reference charge and discharge circuit that is connected to here one switch uh, that will be either moved to this position or moved to uh, yeah moved to the minus 5 voltages so we will see the working of this uh, now here you can see that 
I in as you know that uh, I in is V in by R n V in by R n yeah is converted to a charge by the integrating capacitor C in this integrating capacitor C in charge and uh, it shows up a linearly decreasing voltage VA it is showing up a linearly decreasing voltage because its function as an integrator so linear decreasing voltage VA okay VA linear decreasing at the output of the op amp integrator at the output of the op amp this is op amp integrator at the output of the integrator what what is basically I can say that so here you are applying your input the corresponding current okay the corresponding current uh, that will uh, uh, that is connected to a uh, that is converted to a charge by the that, that this current is converted to a charge by the integrating capacitor C n and because of this uh, there is a linearly decreasing voltage decreasing voltage VA at the output of the op amp integrator okay now the VA can be represented as minus of I in by C in into T where I in is the input current in ampere C in is the integrating cap capacitor and T is the time so you are getting an expression like this now the output of VA integrator is the output of now the output of this VA integrator is sensed by an uh, all of you look into this this comparator sensed by the comparator the output of this comparator is applied to a 3 microsecond delay network uh, to the output transistor Q1 okay output transistor Q1 the and it is connected to a divide by 2 network that, di uh, that drives the output transistor Q2 uh, yeah so and um, you can see that again and uh, C reference discharge charge discharge control circuit now the output of divide by 2 charge uh, this will be yeah output of divide by 2 the output of uh, divide by 2 network drives the output of transistor uh, Q2 now when the output of uh, trans uh, compa uh, this uh, integrator circuit VA is uh, positive when it is positive so there is a comparator you can see that when it is positive uh, it is connected to ground when it is positive certainly VC is positive VC of the moment button is high or uh, it is it may be limited to some plus 5 voltage okay approximately plus 5 voltage and output of VB1 is become yeah the output of VB1 of the 3 microsecond uh, delay network is low or 0 volt that time because only after 3 microsecond this will be reflected uh, so when VB1 is low, Q1 is off and F0 is high, Q1 is off and F0 is high, the divide by 2 network is a negative edge triggered uh, uh, flip flop and whose output voltage, yeah, whose output voltage VB2 is a complement of VB1. Uh, we cannot say complement so we will see how it is working okay so uh, just we will see the the waveform analyze 
so you got some idea and after that we will come to the other features so here this is the uh, waveform of uh, uh, different components of the voltage to a frequency converter so this is the output voltage of the integrator circuit and here you can see that it is v reference that is c reference by c int the reference voltage till that it will be uh, uh, the output of vas can as high as this reference voltage and it will uh, whenever when uh, whenever the integrator yeah whenever this uh, uh, whenever this integrator is activated that time you can see that the output voltage is decreasing now when the integrator voltage is greater than zero output of the comparator is high the output of the comparator is you can see that it is high as soon as it crosses zero that means just less than zero the comparator output become zero okay and we'll see this this much part only comparator output become zero now there is a the uh, output of 3 microsecond delay it gives an inverted output so when you know that uh, this is low after 3 microsecond yes yes uh, yeah yeah after yes after the 3 microsecond the output of 3 microsecond delay become high okay this change will be inversely reflected by 3 microsecond delay here also when this will be after 3 microsecond there is an inverted representations now when this 3 microsecond is high that time when this is high how much time it is high that much time this will be this transistor is on and output is zero otherwise output is f naught so whenever this is high that time the transistor output f naught is zero otherwise it is equal to f naught now divide by 2 output vb1 it is not exactly complement uh, of vb2 you can see that the divide by 2 uh, vb2 is uh, yes it is uh, as you can see that it is a negative it is a negative edge triggered flip flop so uh, I think that we studied this all things negative edge trigger trigger flip flops that means uh, and it is divided by so this is the frequency of your uh, 3 microsecond delay that is the input to the this divide by 2 networks so you know that whenever there is a negative change negative going that time uh, initially suppose if it is high it will go to 0 and next negative going time again output change from 0 to 1 next negative going it will go from uh, high to low that means here you know that uh, if you are taking this this is a complete one cycle uh, here you know that the complete cycle is stretched from here to here that means here the frequencies uh, uh, t is this much here the frequency is double of that no that uh, t is double of the t here is from here to here but here the t is from here to here the t is doubled so frequencies divided by 2 now the uh, this divided by 2 output 
is given to a transistor Q2. Yes, a transistor Q2. So, what happened to here is uh, whenever the transistor uh, divided by 2 is low, the transistor is off, output is high, and whenever the uh, yeah, whenever the divided by 2 is high, that time transistor is on and output is low. So you, you will get a two frequencies. One is F0 and another is F0 by 2. So the, the input voltage is converted into frequency. So it is, so this much will, you should, um, I am giving you this video. The continu continu continuation of this video will be given after this.